She was 33 years old. She had just returned from Paris for the Olympics. Now, Olympic athlete Rebecca Sheptegay is dead. She died from complications after being set on fire by a former boyfriend. The murder has sparked widespread emotion, particularly in her home country, Uganda. Bastien Renouy reports. The first reactions to Rebecca Cheptegay's killing came from Uganda. The Minister for Education and Sport sent his condolences to the family and to Ugandans at large. Then the Uganda Athletics Federation said how deeply saddened it is by the death of its athlete and called for justice. And then later in the day, the family spoke to the media in Eldoret, the town where she died. Of course, they shared their pain. They said how painful it is to lose a sister, a daughter. And then they blamed the Kenyan police. They said that uh, she had been threatened by the man who killed her for a while. Listen to her mother. I have no strength. I just blamed the police in her home of Endebes. They were responsible for providing security for my child's home, but failed. I have nothing else to say. There is now an investigation ongoing. According to the police, 80% of her body was burnt after she was allegedly attacked by a former boyfriend. The police said that a neighbor witnessed the attack. They said that they saw the man pouring a liquid on Cheptegay's body before burning her. This man is now in hospital. He was injured as well. 30% of his body was burnt. He will be arrested as soon as he is discharged from hospital, according to the police.